got some chalk paint um, for our kitchen, which is gonna be yes. so cute. So when you walk in the front door, it will be a whole, there's just a little wall. So we're just gonna do a little chalk wall kind of out of the way. And then Ben, hopefully we'll get this MacGyver together. Well, get it done today. Yeah. <laughs> if he doesn't well, well. <laughs> yeah, right, so one of the two. Okay, so while I was gone, um, Sam taped up the wall for the chalk. Gib really likes the sheet on the ground, don't you Gibby? So yeah, we're gonna paint all of this with the chalk paint and see how it goes. We'll see if the border looks good, if it looks too thick or not. So you can see from here, kitchen is over there, living room's over here, front door is here. So this would be a fun little place to write all of our groceries and the notes and just little things kind of tucked away. So yes, very exciting. have put comfy clothes on and we are just letting this paint dry. I'm trying to take my camera off the tripod right now. Okay, I'm free. All right, so yeah, it looks really cool. It's drying. Um, looks a little thick, but I think it's supposed to look like that. Um, yeah. Oh, looks really bright there. But yeah, we're pretty excited. We cracked a little window freshen things up, but I think it's gonna look super sharp. And in the meantime, my plan is to uh, hang up the lights in my room because we finally got hooks today and Ben repainted the ceiling after he ripped it and peeled off some of the paint, inevitably. And you know, love him, but he totally, totally like ripped up. Oh, can you see it? It's okay, it'll be fine. We're gonna put these cute lights up here. So they'll hang, and I got these little hooks today which will hold them just nicely. So Ben and Will are also at the same time finishing up the vegetable box. Oh, and this is the mama we brought home from uh, Home Depot today, and she is gonna live on the front porch. She's so nice, has all these great branches. Don't mind our ferns, which are sad right now. If you have any advice on how to keep our ferns alive, let us know. Last summer, I had no problem with my ferns. <sighs> Anyways, um, we also didn't really think about the fact that the base is really small, like it fit but there's not really a lot of growing room for the pot, so we might get a new pot for this, similar to the ones we got for our other plants, and then we might put my cute little rubber plant, the moody one, in that guy. And I think it'll look really chic with the black fireplace, so, you know, that's what's happening here. But the guys are out here, and they're finishing, they're putting the third layer on, and I think they have plans to build some shelving. I don't know what they're gonna get done today, but they're busy working away. Sam and I went and got the wood for them over there. So yeah, they're kind of busy doing that, and Ben needed a tape measure, so uh, I was like, if only I had a little string or something, and Sam's like, oh, you mean this? <laughs> So uh, I'm gonna try to, I don't know, they just need to look sort of symmetrical, you know? So yeah, anyways, I'm gonna give this a try. Sam is very carefully touching up all the spots where we got chalk paint on the wall. Not all, the couple spots. The couple spots. You already can't even tell. Yeah. Yeah. It's like you see the lines. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I just finished putting um, the light up. We've got a hook in the ceiling. My heart is racing. I was so nervous doing that. I don't know why. It's like a very big screw into the ceiling. And I did not want to pick it up. <laughs> I was just trying to be so straight. <sighs> so I got one done. I feel good about that. It's super bright in here though, so it's kind of 
Very nice. One done. Inside. Now we've got to do 